We are officially going to find out if the Ninja Creamy can make better ice cream than our favorite viral ice cream maker. But we've never used a Ninja Creamy before, so we got to figure all that out first. Which is kind of exciting because I've heard a lot of good things about the Ninja Creamy. We have made ice cream with this like a thousand times. And it is good. It is so good. Every time it's been so good. So we're going to make ice cream with this. We're going to make ice cream with this. The only difference is that we've got to pre-make the ice cream for this and it's got to freeze for 24 hours. So we're going to do that really quick, unbox it, get a good feel for it because like I've tried Ninja Creamy ice cream two times now. The fact that we have to wait 24 hours, that's one point for the, that the is, ball. I know. I think you need more ingredients for this, maybe? But you can make ice cream in 30 minutes. This, you've got to pre-make it and you've got to wait 24 hours. But if you pre-make a lot, you're good to go. Yeah, and if it tastes better, I don't care. I like to be a planner. I don't, I'm not a very good one, but I like to. I kind of like throwing this around too. It's fun. Then we're gonna do a taste test. I mean, this thing is a machine. Also, you know what I'm really excited about? Oh, I'm so jealous right now. Oh, it's so Wait, save good. one for me. No, sorry. You always get to do it. <laughs> it's, just, it's my turn. Wrong. Wow, that is clean. That looks good. Okay, so we've watched a lot of videos. We've looked up recipes and we found one that we like. It's simple. It looks delicious. It doesn't have a lot of calories. It's got great protein. And then I think, I, like are people even doing this for like delicious treats or is it all about like, let's make ice cream out of low calorie, high protein stuff. That's all I'm seeing. Let us know <laughs> if you know. But the thing that I'm pumped about is that people have made really, really good ice cream and it's low calorie and it's high protein, so. Win-win. Win-win. I like the idea of chocolate milk. I like the idea of caramel toffee. Cottage cheese. Yeah, that's the thing that freaks me out. We have sampled this recipe before. It was delicious, but cottage cheese? I don't, I don't like cottage cheese. Gonna try it. I'll probably love it. I loved it last time. Okay, tell me what to do. Okay, put one half cup cottage cheese. That looks good. Ooh. Perfect. Okay. Half a cup of egg whites. Shake it well, it says. Okay. What would I do without you? Ooh. Ooh. Weird. One fourth cup of whole milk. One fourth cup of milk? One scoop of that caramel toffee protein. That'd be good. We also have this mint cookie kind too. I'm gonna just eat this thing for breakfast. It's like 330 calories and like 40 grams of protein or something like that. Next is the syrup. Sugar-free syrup? Two tablespoons. Is sugar-free syrup good? I've never had it. Should I drink some? Sure. Boom, boom, boom. Okay. Does that look good? We stopped at the exact same time. Vanilla? I don't want to do too much. I love vanilla, but it, it is One teaspoon. strong. One teaspoon. What's next? Blend and freeze. How do we blend it? Do we blend it with this beforehand? I don't know. Just mix it. All right. See you tomorrow. 24 hours later. Okay, 24 hours later, we've got my viral ball ice cream maker, and it is just about ready to go. All you have to do is put ice, and then you put about a half a cup of rock salt in it. You can just get this anywhere but the rock salt makes it so, this is like the most confusing thing to me because salt melts ice outside, but this salt makes it so this ice can get colder without melting. Makes no sense. Either way, we've tried it before, it works. I am a big fan of this ice cream because like I said yesterday, it's really easy to make. Only takes about 30 minutes. Now, is that a good thing or a bad thing? I probably just dump in all of this, right? That's about a pint left. Why are you looking at me like that? <laughs> I just, I'm surprised you're not measuring cups. You're I'm just full worried. sending I'm it. I'm not worried about it. I think the one thing you want to measure is the vanilla because you don't want too much vanilla. Not the sugar? No, sugar is delicious. Cream, delicious. Sweet condensed milk, delicious. Alright, here we go. I think that's about a pint left. The recipe that we have that comes with the instructions of this ice cream, it does not call for sweet condensed milk. My beautiful, amazing, talented, genius wife thought we should put it in there and it made it so good. Some crushed up Oreos and some sugar, a little bit of vanilla. We're good to go. Then we just kick it around. The kicking around of the ice cream ball is fun. I'd say it kind of gets old though. 
<laughs> it's kind of like ten I minutes don't know. in, it's like we still have twenty minutes. Ten minutes in, it's like okay. There's the two tablespoons. I mean, more sugar and ice cream. It's never a bad thing. We have two Ninja Creamy ice creams that we are gonna make. One is the protein one that we made yesterday, and then we made the exact same recipe, and we put it in a container and froze it. So clearly not exactly the same. <laughs> Nothing's gonna be exactly the same. <laughs> All right, now I'm just gonna put a couple chunks of Oreos in here. One thing I'm concerned about with the Ninja Creamy is I like chunky Oreos in my ice cream. Like, I like chunks. I feel like the Ninja Creamy- There's a mix-in button. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah, you blend it and then you add the mix-ins and it stirs it. Okay, they're, they're thinking. They're way ahead of you. Yeah, they are. Okay, I think this is ready to go. Would you say it's ready to go? Are you sure. excited? Mostly. All right, let's do it. After about 15 minutes, we take it out, we stir it up a little bit, and then we go for another 15 minutes. We're just gonna keep on going. 20 minutes, now they say that you need to open it. Oh, it's like really good on it. Oh, so you tightened it really hard. There we go. Oh, it looks so good. Take all the ice cream off the edges and then go for another 10 minutes. This is looking good, like it always does. Okay, we'll see you again in 10 minutes. 10 minutes later. Okay, the ice cream in the ice cream making ball is almost ready. We thought it'd be best to actually compare the exact same recipe that we put in the ice cream making ball with the Ninja Creamy. So we made that last night as well. We've got this right here. We're gonna go ahead and Blend it up, then we'll scoop out the ice cream and the ice cream making ball and see which one's better. Then we'll blend up this, this interesting cottage cheese egg white protein caramel ice cream. Okay, I've watched videos on this. I think I know what I'm doing. It's not necessarily working out right now. There we go, perfect. Okay, so this is my first time using this. Hold and twist. Okay, we gotta lock it into place. What? What? That was fun. Yeah, it was fun. It felt cool too. It's plugged in, I think. Turn it on. This is my first time using this. Did I say that already? <laughs> Push ice cream. Light ice cream, right? Why, why light? Because I've heard light ice cream is better than just making ice cream. I want ice cream. You, okay. Heard from who? The internet. Okay, I'm going to press ice cream. Oh. Here we go. It's happening. Okay. Does that mean it's done? Let's check it out. Hold and twist. That is so fun. That's a milkshake. <laughs> Whoops. It looks good though. Let's try the mix-in button. How did they do that though? That was so frozen. Let's throw a couple mix-ins in. Let's see how well the mix-in button works. And also I really like to do this. There we go. Okay, this is done now. This is done now. Let's dish up and see which one's the best. Any bets? Any ideas on what you think is gonna be the better one? I think that one's gonna be the best because we put more love into it. This one? Hard work. It is hard work. Ooh. And it looks delicious, look at this. I think this one is really, really cool and it's fun. And it's like, if you're having a family party, people playing out in the backyard, you throw some ice cream in this, everybody's throwing it around for 30 minutes, then you can enjoy some ice cream because you worked hard for Then it. you can all have a bite of ice cream. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> the Ninja Creamy though, I feel like maybe that's like a, it's like an everyday kind of thing. You buy a couple extra pints and then you've got a quick and easy, after you've done the prep, you've got a quick and easy ice cream that you can make. But it also does slushies, milkshakes. Yeah. Okay, there's that ice cream. This one looks delicious. It is mixed in too. We're gonna go off of flavor here. Oh, this is the way I like ice cream too. Okay, here's yours. Both set up. We wanted to make sure that we tested out the same recipe and we thought about that this morning. This one has only been freezing for about eight hours. So, I still think it will, oh, it's still thick. This is the Ninja Creamy right here. It's creamy. It's creamy and it's, it is pretty good. Here's the viral ice cream making ball one. Mmm, that's good too. Mmm. It's all good. Tastes the exact same. I wonder if it's because it's the exact same recipe. <laughs> okay, you know what we need to do? This one froze for 24 hours. Let's blend this one up and then see what that consistency looks like. At this point, it's like a preference thing. It's like, how do you want your ice cream to be made? That's it. <laughs> do you prefer to play with the ball for half an hour first? Or do you prefer 
to have some really loud noise going. Through. Yeah. I don't know how long was that. Both a couple are fine. minutes. Yeah, both are fine. I'm not gonna judge you for how you like your ice cream to be made. Okay, this just finished up. Let's see what it looks like. I am excited to try this one. Oh, it's perfect. It looks so good. See? Our weird caramel. Eggy. Eggy cottage cheese ice cream. We thought it'd be good to put these in with it too. So I think it's gonna be good. But this looks good. That is a crazy consistency. That's like ice cream. You gotta put some of these in there. I'll let you get yours. Two of those. That's like a perfect consistency. Whoa. Whoa. That is super good. That's like a perfect texture. That is perfect. That's good. That is like, that is a treat. And what was the macros on it? It was like 40 grams of protein, 300 calories total. That's good. Speechless. I know, I kind of am. I don't think it's possible to get this kind of texture with the ice cream making ball. Even though the ice cream making ball is really good, I don't think it does this. And we've used it quite a few times. I like it. I'm a fan. I'm gonna make weird ice cream all the time now. For breakfast. I can eat that for breakfast. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. It's like my childhood dreams coming true. I don't know, after tasting that, that wins. I'll for sure use this way more than I use that. Oh yeah. You don't want to make breakfast ice cream in the ball with me every morning? It could be part of our workout. Yeah, I don't want to do that. 